a set of SEG images, sagittal images as we call them. These images are acquired as a volume data and with the help of the computer that comes with your CT scan machine, you can reconstruct this data as axial set of images or coronal set of images or sagittal set of images. They are also known as MPR, multi planar reconstructions. So this is a set of images that is reconstructed as sagittal images. They are equivalent to a lateral view. The difference is they are in slices and for that reason they have much better definition for the anatomy and for the pathology if there is any. This is anterior side of the patient. This is posterior side. These are ribs and this is superior aspect and this is inferior aspect. This is diaphragm and this is right lung. We'll go from medial side to lateral side and the only purpose of today's video is to learn or refresh a little bit of anatomy and these set of images can be a wonderful tool for newbies, the beginners that are learning about the the macroscopic anatomy of right lung. So we'll see different lobes in this video. So I'll move down. The next cut will be more lateral. So I'm moving down and as you can see these fine lines, three of them. This is oblique fissure in right lung also known as major fissure. This is horizontal fissure or minor fissure. Left lung does not have this one. So there is only upper lobe and lower lobe in case of left lung. This is right lung. It has an oblique fissure and a horizontal fissure. So this is right upper lobe. This is right middle lobe and as you can see it's anterior. Always remember right middle lobe is anterior. This is right lower lobe which is posterior. Superior aspect is adjacent to right upper lobe and anteriorly it has right middle lobe. Now there is another lobe in this case. Some people can have extra lobe and extra fissure but for the purpose of learning we'll just ignore this one because most of the people have just three lobes right upper lobe right middle lobe and right lower lobe so we'll just ignore this for the purpose of learning but this patient has an extra fissure and an extra lobe this is a variation which can happen um, to a number of patients certain certain percentage of patients have accessory lobes these uh, fissures they're made up of double layer of visceral pleura and these fissures separate upper, middle and lower lobes. This is scapula, right scapula and these are anterior ribs and these are posterior ribs. Thank you very much.